All right, here we are, and now we are uh, going to demonstrate the empty hand application uh, of these lines. Okay, we can do this with uh, mano mano, uh, and we can do this with uh, uh, panantukan, uh, elbow strikes, and all type of empty hand uh, type of situations. Uh, uh, follow these lines for uh, using using them for takedowns and uh, grappling situations and, and all, all this kind of stuff, all right? But what, I, what I'm going to demonstrate is I'm not going to I'm not going to demonstrate all that, right? What I'm going to demonstrate is just the lines, keeping it in the format in the in the feeder receiver uh, uh, training that that we've been doing with the uh, uh, single stick uh, machete double blade um, and spotty daga machete machete uh, long blade and short blade, okay? And then now. We're going to use the, the empty hand uh, portion here, okay? I'm going to use a Panantukan style, Filipino boxing uh, style, and what I'm going to do is do this, okay? So my first move on the line is this, okay? So the first line was this, right? This is the first line, and then the second line was the clear, and then the third line was down like that. So this is the movement of the line. This is the movements of the line, okay? This is the movement when I had a blade in my hand, uh, a stick in my hand, or, or a weapon, okay? In this case, my hands are the weapon. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to follow that line, but I'm not going to come in a wide angle like this, okay? Because I don't want to chop. I don't want to palm. I can, but that's not what I want to do right now, right? What I want to do right now is I want to come in with a straight punch, okay? Like a boxing move, pop, okay? Because this is more common, right? Pop, when it come like that, okay? If I want to, we're going to go like this for a minute. If I want to, pop, I can come in like that too, pop, because that's the, line, that's the line that I use here, pop, hit, and then come like that. If I want to, I can do that, but I don't want to. <laughs> Right now, what I want to do is I want to go right here, uh, just regular, uh, basic type jab. Ha! That's my line. Ha! That's my line. Ha! That's my line. Okay. Now my second line was this one here, right? So what do I do with that? I'm gonna add a palm strike on that. So I'm gonna one, ha! and I'm gonna like that. One, ha! I'm gonna like that. One, ha! and I'm gonna like that. One, ha! and I'm gonna like that. One, ha! Okay. And then on the third one was my line was over here. So I'm gonna use a hook to the body. So I'm gonna pop, and I'm gonna hook and hook to the body. So I'm gonna pop, and then hook to the body. How does this look? Let's do it right here one moment. Okay, I come here, right? My hands on guard, I shoot, boom! From here, I hit, palm, strike, nose, or blind them. So it's one, boom! Okay, for that split second, I'm gonna hit to the body, bah! Like that, okay? If I shoot one, two, and he shoots hook to the head, I duck, wah! And I go to the body and palm, bah! Again to the top, following the rhythm. Right? So I go, one second, one second, I go one, two, three, one, two, three, like that, right? And if he throws that as a hook, I go one, two, boom, one, and again hook it, two, boom, one, two, boom, one, two, whoop, and <laughs> one, palm, whoop, like that, all right? That's just in case if that comes like that, that's again following the line, following the motion, following the footwork, and coming back. Doing the triangle, doing the triangle with bobbing and weaving, adding all other type of uh, elements that uh, uh, that we do in our training, okay, to make it more applicable.